A lot of people in my life that I've met are on two different sides. One say that they love God and they call him father and others say that they don't believe and he's imaginary. But I have a question for the ones that say he is your father. There's a story in the Bible in John chapter seven where Jesus is talking to these Pharisees. Uh, for those of you who don't know, Pharisees is like rulers or leaders of the religious law. And they were arguing back and forth with Jesus because they were claiming to be children of God just because of their status, right? Because they were born into this religion. They were born into this doctrine. And they, by default, claimed themselves to be children of God. And Jesus was standing there before them and he was telling them that they didn't know God. Jesus, right in their face, told them that their father was the devil because they didn't allow truth in their hearts and they didn't want to recognize God's real voice. So my question to you, you who are watching and care enough to hear this message is who is your father i'm not talking about maury i'm talking about spiritually who do you tend to lean on the most is it your feelings your emotions are those things the things that dictate the way you move the way you treat other people according to your emotions or is god really your father god isn't looking for people who are robots god isn't looking for people who know all the right things to say god isn't looking for people who dress a certain way and talk a certain way he's looking for people who will seek him in spirit and in truth i loves each and every one of his children but the question is do you love him back this is how you know that god is your father do you prioritize him do you spend time with him are you in relationship and fellowship with him do you walk in the holy spirit not perfection but do you dictate your life around him or do you dictate your life around you and then welcome god when you need help the Lord is saying to many people out there, you are my children, I paid the price for you, but many of you choose to follow the devil and many of you choose to close your ears off to truth. So by default, your father is the devil. Get away from the hands of the devil, get away from the deception of the devil because he's trapping you in a deception. You believe the lie that he feeds you because your heart is wicked and I am the only one who can heal the wickedness in your heart. I paid the price for your sins, so draw near to me so you can understand my voice and truly get redeemed truly recognize that you are a son and a daughter of the kingdom of heaven and not this earth in the name of jesus god bless